Today in New Haven, religious leaders and police officers will stand side by side to talk about the relationship between police and community in New Haven. It comes during National Police Week and a time of growing tensions around the country between police and the communities in which they serve. News 8's Ken Pierce is live from New Haven with more. Good morning, Kent. Good morning, Allie and Jim. What this is going to consist of, it's New Haven's police chief, New Haven's mayor, coming here to police headquarters to meet with members of the local clergy. And the press advisory about this meeting says that they're going to be talking about tension, violence, and strained relationships between police and the community. And it comes in a time when that is on everybody's mind. Baltimore is still getting over the riots surrounding the death of Freddie Gray while in police custody. And no one has forgotten about Michael Brown in Ferguson, Missouri, or Eric Garner in Staten Island, New York. And it comes as the weather is warming up, which is usually when street crime in New Haven increases as well. Chief Esserman says he has a monthly meeting with local pastors at which he talks about neighborhood issues and possible solutions. And this is just going to be an extension of those monthly meetings, one which includes the mayor and the press. This one is said to have a special agenda, though, including department recruiting, programs for young people, and something called de-escalation training. That is teaching officers how to keep a situation from escalating to the point where they believe that force is necessary. We're live outside New Haven Police Headquarters this morning. I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.